Hi, I'm Mr. Omingyo. Okay, I'm going to go through the four main components of electricity, which are charge, current, voltage, and resistance. So the difficult part about electricity, right, is that we cannot see, we cannot touch, we cannot feel electricity. So, um, how do I go about explaining, right? I will use an analogy of a waterfall. Okay, this is a circuit. So in a circuit, right, the charges will be moving from one end to the other end. Okay. So, um, in a waterfall, what is equivalent to the charges will be the water. Because the water, the water, they are flowing downwards. Okay. So, uh, just write down here. Charges in a circuit are like uh, water in a waterfall. Okay, next. Uh, we know that the current... is the rate of flow of charge that means it's how fast the charges are flowing every second so for current right it's actually equivalent to the rate of flow of water as well as in how fast is the water flowing down the, the waterfall so this will be the rate of flow of water okay um, next thing what is the thing that is causing the the charges to flow so in this case the battery the battery is the thing that provides the voltage for the uh, charges to flow so this is the voltage and this is equivalent to the height of the waterfall because the height of the waterfall is is the thing that is causing the water to flow down. If the waterfall is flat, then the charges will not flow at all. Okay? So the voltage in a circuit is equivalent to the height of a waterfall. Okay, and lastly, in a circuit there is a resistance Okay, there is a resistor. So this resistor poses a resistance to the the movement of the charges. So on a waterfall, right, there is also uh there are also stones. So these thick stones here is going to obstruct the flow of the water. Okay, so the resistance the resistance in a circuit is equivalent is equivalent to stones on a waterfall.